winch this truck about 200 yards and flat tires and that wheel's locked up. They're just winching it, changing positions, winching. And we're almost there. The old Harbor Spray winch is doing great. The Bronco is a perfect job, perfect tool for this job. This is the shop. This is where we're going. Pulling the transmission. It's a pretty cool truck too. It's a F F250, the 351 with a five-speed four-wheel drive. It's crank windows with no AC from the factory, which you don't see too many like that. And we don't have the key, so we had to just pry this and break the whole steering hole in there. So the steering wheel came unlocked. And that's how we're getting her done. There's only, the, the truck was parked in like 2015, I think. And it's a running driving truck, so the transmission shouldn't need much work before it goes into my F-150. So that's cool. Little truck Sean's got out here. It was like a 92, 93 F-250 with the 7.3 IDI, naturally aspirated. One second. With a uh, ZF5 four-wheel drive. That's some nice trucks out here, that's for sure. Yeah, 92. Come out. TJ, no brakes. It has no brakes, watch out. Is cut to pull the engine because Sean wants to keep the engine and I've got everything disconnected here so I need to all right there's a better view you get the uh, transmission bell housing bolts and then uh, the motor mount I mean transmission mount bolts right there and then drop the tray coming along Retiring. All right. Finally got the transmission out with the T case. It's in good shape. Just got some mildew in it for sitting for so long. Yep. Yep. Clutches on the engine. 